You know where I'm at with this whole Jeep? About ready to start cutting my wrists. <laughs> um, it is new. It is it's new. not like the TJ. Right. Uh, Infinitely easier to work on, right? Or no? Oh, yeah. All right, okay. Wow, that's rusting. Oh, crap. Welcome back, everybody. So today we are going to do a really quick video for you. Um, we've already installed one of these before on Bob's TJ, but it's time for another one. And on your JL. I don't, did we do a video on your JL one? I don't know if we did a video on that. Anyway, obviously you can tell we're big fans because this is the third one. Third one. This is my second one. Yeah. So <laughs> the company is Brawly. They sell this product on Amazon. We're not dealers. We're not endorsed. We bought the damn thing. Whatever. We don't care. We'll put anything on this channel just to have fun because that's what we do. Uh, so we, Bob bought this on Amazon, had it shipped to his house, and we're going to throw it on today because of the style of the overlanding slash camping slash everything we do. This light is just amazing for yeah. when it comes oh, time yeah. to cook, and I'm a huge fan of his cooking, so I think he needs to have a light. Let's see what it looks like. It is... I imagine it's probably substantially longer than the TJ. Yeah, and I think these, uh, if I recall, have a slight curvature to the, uh, the back, do they not? <clears throat> sure. I'll go know. with that. They don't? I don't know. I don't either. I don't even pay attention to that crap. All I remember is make sure you order the right one. So I try to order the right one. I think there's more crap in there. There is. Yeah, they make these for JKs, TJs, oh. JLs. They make several different versions. I don't remember seeing that before. And uh, Maybe you we have just to use them. power cord in your remote. It's coming. So I've had uh, mine coming. on. And to be honest with you, I was pretty much expecting this Brawly light stuff to be just cheap Chinese crap. I did not expect it to live long because, well, I just have low expectations when it comes to Chinese crap. That being said, mine has been on there for a year and a half now. Yep. And it works as amazing as it did this day one. And Bob, you are correct. It does have a little bit of a curve to it. That's what just I thought. Just a little teeny bit. So I did not expect this to be some killer, fantastic, thing a product. But that being said, I'm a year and a half in. I've not had a single failure whatsoever. Not one. It works just as amazing now as it did the day we put it in. It, it actually puts out a pretty decent amount of light. It does, and I'll say I don't, you know, so we put the one on my TJ. I mean, it's not, it's not only used when I'm overlanding because, you know, in all honesty, we haven't overlanded my TJ since I got the JL. <laughs> so, yep. but, but I have used the light, right? So whenever you're in the back doing something, um, uh, you know, I don't know, working in the back doing something. I mean, it just provides a, a ton of light in the back. Uh, you know, if you're Yep. In, the, in the need for you know for any sort of reason I guess so here we go Eric's gonna know what all this stuff does I know these are 3m sticky things for the wires those are the wires here's the remote yep there's a quick there is a quick disconnect yep there is a quick for disconnect. those of you I don't know if we showed that in any uh, the other video but there's a quick disconnect for when you take your hard top off it just, um, un un uh, just un unhook yep. it and you're done and you go all, all right. right let's put this thing on let's put it on did the hard part, I cleaned it off with an alcohol wipe. I mean, that was the hard part, right? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry to be clear. Ken was, uh, was busy. He couldn't, uh, couldn't do it. Pneumatic rotary tool, does it have a name? Air grinder. Air grinder. Hey, or pencil grinding? grinder. Now, Bob, I'm winging this. <laughs> Making sure.
All right, Ken. Eric, as usual, did a phenomenal job. Correct. On the install. I, uh, I mean, I already know what it's going to do. What do you think it's going to do? <laughs> Pow. We got light. We got light. Is this, uh, now it does have different modes. That's 100%. It does 50. 50, 25. And it's got disco mode. <laughs> when we're having a rager in the middle of the... Uh, It'd be a rave. It's a rave, you old man. Not a rager. It's a rave. I'm from the 90s, though. Okay. 80s? We'll go rager. Is that... I don't know. I'm not young. There's all sorts of different modes. Anyway, what I was going to say we is when, we're, ha when we're having a rave in the middle of the uh, New Mexican desert, we, we can, can have tacos. a dance party. And make tacos. And make ta Well, we're going to make tacos. We have to make tacos. And this will provide the light. Um, so we had a lot of tacos. Said, Let there be light. So on our trip uh, last year, Ken had one of these. I did not. Um, it provided more than enough light as we, you know, uh, backed our, our Jeeps up tailgate to tailgate uh, to provide, you know, enough to do all the cooking. Because pretty much every night it was dark <laughs> out when we got there. Yep. Uh, so we were able to make our tacos Steaks. and our steaks. And the quesadillas and the fajitas that we made a couple times. That'd be um, awesome. Problem set the tents up, all sorts of stuff. Oh, absolutely. Uh, yeah, I mean, and, and like you said, for as inexpensive it's of an upgrade cheap. as this is, and it took all of about 10 minutes yeah. to install. You just search on Amazon. It's Brawley Light, you know, for JL, JK, TJ, whatever you have, they have these. They're super cheap. They're actually pretty darn easy to install. And honestly, Remote said, control. we've had it for quite a while, and there's been no issues whatsoever. I didn't even put a battery in it yet. So, like... That's a, good point. That's a good thing. point. It's actually, it's actually pretty remarkable. Every, if you're into overlanding, definitely need one of these. Yep. So. All right, there's a quick video. See you guys next Wednesday.